get back into it. So, the Checkpoint League has returned in the form of our Bellatrio one-shot, which we had the first day of yesterday, and I managed to place in the top two in my group. So I'll be in the final tomorrow morning at about, uh, I think it's 11 Pacific is when we're starting, so 12 o'clock my time. About, uh, it's about right now, actually, so it's about 24 hours from now is when we should expect the Bellatrio finals. And I need to practice because I think I might be the least likely to win of the four. I had the lowest final score of the four of us, so I gotta get some, I gotta get some good runs in the books here. So let's do it. Will we see E today, Bear? I certainly hope so. I honestly, I think I'm gonna get a little more selective with my starts here as well. More than likely, just gonna try to get a nice first tag to start us off. This looks like a full house situation to me. Try it anyway. No luck. They did pretty well. They just had some really runaway RNG in the end. Yeah, and I mean, I'm certainly anticipating that's going to be a big factor is whether or not we're able to get those super runs to pop off. I am mostly playing yellow deck as well. Yeah, I have been strongly considering going for black deck because I do think that that deck has way more inherent potential with the additional joker slot. So I'm giving that some thought, but yellow deck absolutely affords me more opportunities to succeed as opposed to black deck, which very frequently ends in the first couple of annies just because it's so much more difficult to clear some of those later ones with only three hands. You underestimate how big of a difference it makes to have the additional one. I no longer underestimated, but initially you do. That's probably a skip. Let's go for this polychrome here. And again, yeah, I, I'm operating uh, under the assumption that most people that are still tuning in for the Bellatro have a pretty good understanding of the game, but if you have any questions about how anything's happening, feel free to let me know. I'm pretty experienced with it at this point. We go for the full house again, although we don't really have the foundation for that, do we? I guess we could go for the club flush. Yeah, that's not terrible. Two pair, I suppose. No, that's not gonna be good enough. I think we need to go ahead and do this. Gotta get at least one bigger hand here. I think this will be it. Nice. The thing that throws me is Bellaccio starts out on just poker and then mutates rapidly as you play into something wholly distinct. That's a lot of the appeal of the game, actually, yeah. Ooh, that's a fun one. We got the hieroglyph as well here, so we're gonna get a polychrome parrot paradalia, I guess is how you'd say that. Which on its own is not super significant, but the fact it's polychrome, of course, is really nice, and then we can absolutely make a lot of builds out of this. There's several common jokers, in fact, that benefit pretty heavily from being able to redeem more face cards, so hopefully we can find one of those. Just reset here, yeah. Tempting to go for the straight flush. I think this plays safer. Try my dandest to get us a hand that'll clear the 300 on its own. To try to save a little money, and sure enough, there that'll do it with the polychrome. Now we are looking for stuff like Scary Face, which is outstanding. So now. All cards are considered face cards, and we get an additional 30 chips for each face card scored. So that's a really nice foundation there. Let's go for this Arcana pack, too. Yeah, it's your random tarot. That's not a bad idea. Okay. I love that Joker with the face cards turn gold Joker. Ooh, yeah, that's fun. Just 
just a deck full of gold cards. That's a good time. Let's try to hit that full house again. You feel like you have some good new strats after commentating yesterday? Absolutely, yeah. I feel like that helped me out a lot to learn about like the things that Apollo values and just seeing chat talking about the game has been really helpful for me. So we're already going to be very easily clearing these blinds now. So now it's a matter of trying to get our economy going. Let's take a look at the buffoon pot pack for that. That's something we could build into, I suppose, if I wanted to maybe like... That's, a, that's, that's an option. Could start getting rid of non-face cards as well and then eventually just actually have a face card deck. Speaking of which, maybe a hangman here. Ah, Hermit's pretty good, yeah. Or not, yeah, Hermit. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. It was really fun to commentate on the Bellatro tournament. Yeah, that I, it's like a, it's a great spectator sport. I was telling uh, Corey, it feels like Magic the Gathering tournaments, where with the just the level of complexity involved, and there's so many different things to discuss when it comes to, the, to strategy. It was really fun. Face cards are uh, Jack's kings and queens, Yeti. AKA a card with a face on the art. TCL's a checkpoint league. It's an event that uh, was primarily focused around Apollo's Super Mario Maker levels a couple of years ago. A few years ago, wasn't it? Yeah, geez, that was like during the pandemic. Uh, that has now become a, uh, a, a sort of catch-all for the uh, tournaments that Apollo runs on his channel for the NLSS crew. Sorry, I hit a button on my monitor on accident. There we go. I'm gonna go for this Jumbo Arcana again. Another Emperor card. Eh, I think a Hermit's probably the best here. They got money for sale again. Let's do that. Hey, Frothy, welcome. Yeah, neither of these are all that great. I'm pretty sure we got enough Jokers to Keep us going for a minute now. I like the hone, though. F future polychrome possibility. There's a foil. Ooh, foil negative. That's a good double skip right there. Yeah, that's worth it. We're easily going to clear this 1600, too. Although, unfortunately, it is going to decrease the level of the hand played. Let's go for this flush again, I suppose. Gotta keep in mind, all cards are face cards, so we don't really have to worry about that. Four of a kind, almost certainly not really going to happen here until we're able to build into it later, but it's good to have for future potential. Yeah, honestly, this is a pretty solid foundation here. Again, if we can just find something to get the economy going, that'd be outstanding, and hopefully we can get lucky with this negative, too. Negative hearts is fine, honestly. That's pretty good. We've got the foil on the ride the bus, unfortunately, which is not at all going to work for our build, so we're just going to go ahead and leave that. But that's a fun negative joker. Double spectral here, too. This could be good. Let's see. Got a red seal, got a purple seal. I think I'll take the purple seal. I think that's going to be better for us early on here. Let's see what this one gives us. Ouija. Interesting. That would help our four of a kind a lot, actually. Yeah, that's a good idea. All threes, baby. Which are also face cards. Okay. Let's take the reroll surplus, too. That's a good investment for later. And an uncommon hollow. Huh. All spades are debuffed. We can deal with that. Cool. Alright, we're looking for hearts and threes part here. It's going to be what scores well for us. Not finding a ton, though. Oh, there we go. Two random planets is nice. I think I'll go for a glass three here. That should be enough to one-shot this. I was going to say Mars would be nice to see here, too. Yeah, that's terrific. Let's give this a shot. 
Nice. Kept the glass three, too. Good shit. I guess I should put that at the end, huh? Yeah. Oh, no, that makes more sense to do it that way. Ooh, Mary Andy. Plus three discards, minus one hand size. We're already doing minus one hand size, so that's... That's interesting. The fact that it's hollow makes me want to take it, but I'm not super sure about that one. I'm going to take ice cream as well. It's nice for the chip bonus for a little while. And I guess I'll send it. Okay. I think I need to get some more shops here. Again, we're looking pretty good right now. It's just... I need to start worrying about future scaling potential. And I think I want to build around this four of a kind now that we got that Ouija. I think it's a good idea. Freeze all day. Could be a good, good plan. Ooh, a strength card is excellent for us now too. And if we can get any more threes, I guess I should go for it. Or Polychrome Nine's pretty sick. Also a Steel Queen. I think a Steel Queen is help, more helpful actually, because we're not going to be playing nines all that often, I assume. Okay. Right on cue. God damn it. Uh, um, I think I, I really just think I should go for threes because I still only have the one other nine in here. The odds that we're going to get four threes are still way higher than getting four nines. Plus, I want to look for a two to increase as well. The strength card. Yeah, there we go. That's probably easily going to clear it. in there too. Yeah, nice. Good stuff. At what point does the option to play fewer than five cards come in? That's always on the table, yeah. You can you can play as many cards as you want for your hand. You can. I've, I've played a lot of one-card hands in the past. Uh, blue Joker is better than ice cream, so we'll just go ahead and take that as a replacement. Make a spectral again here. That's pretty sick. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh boy, this is this is wacky. I'm gonna do it though. So we're now down to a, a hand size of five. <laughs> That's an achievement unlock too, which is fun. And did add negative to the blue Joker, which is honestly really good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. And then I don't want to destroy a three. I don't want to destroy any of these. So. I guess just take a chance on this. Oh, that works out. All right, that's fine. Cool. That's really good. Keep going. Now we just try to find four threes with our many, many discards. And that shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, there we go. This is hilarious, though. I've never played with such a small hand size. Hell yeah. Okay. Send it. Overstock is really good. I think I just hold here, though. Negative again. Holy shit, that's crazy. Love to see it. I'm trying to find some twos as well. I don't know if I can keep these steel cards anymore. That seems like a gamble. Seems like way too big of a gamble, actually, yeah. Oh, there's a two. Nice. And there's another three. I'm gonna have to play the glass one this time. Nice. Yeah, still easily clearing these blinds. Incoming water boss blind with zero discards. Oh, really? Are you messing with me, or is that actually happening? Because that'd be really bad. I'm going to buy and use this for the strength card. Actually, I'm going to keep this, and then I'm going to keep my death. So I can turn these into more threes. And that's probably good. Nah, it's the hook. Okay, we're fine. So we're going to go ahead and convert a four into a three here. And then we're going to discard these guys, and then do the same to another one. And then like this, and then go like this. Better to get threes of hearts, I guess, since we have the lusty joker in the in the negative slot. But that's really greedy to go for. 
I really shouldn't have done that. Although I guess I can always... Oh, yeah, yeah, I can, I can use it to death no matter what, so yeah, that was worth it. Cool. So now we have... Eight threes in this deck. That's really good. Okay. Got another negative joker as well. Plus one hand size. Yo, nice. We still have an open joker slot here too, which is crazy. There's a hollow. I'll take it. I'll take $40 too. Yeah, that's a great idea. Good decision. I've ever had eight Joker slots either. This is pretty outrageous. Ooh, this is bad. I didn't think about this modifier here. Hmm. Oh no. Okay, well these are threes. So I guess I better just do this. Okay. I think actually what I need to do is just do this. I don't think it's going to work, though. Holy, wow, that was, that was bold, but worked out. Goodness, that was really close. And the times, oh, this is good. If we can keep getting the four of a kind here, this is, supernova is really helpful. That's the number of times the hand has been played to the multiplier and is holographic. That's good. And then, oh yeah, voucher. The telescope is really nice here too. And then we get ourselves some money for sale. $34 from the Arcana there is insane. And then we can hangman to destroy non-threes. Oh shit. That's really good. I guess a glass card's helpful. Not really. Stencil not gonna do anything. Emperor's good. Oh, nice. Hmm. How do I do this? I don't wanna waste my fool here. But I do want to make these. I actually think I should do this. Oh, that was worth. Wow, that was awesome. Hell yeah. Turn that into way more money. Okay. Sadly, not landing on the rolls here. Campfire is really good. Ooh. Ooh, boy. I think it's time to get rid of Mary Andy. Pick up the campfire here. And then I'm gonna start feeding that immediately. Alright, let's see. Get into our four of a kind again. We only got our hand size back, but we don't have as many discards now. Kind of balances out, I guess. Beautiful. Alright, so now we're just buying and selling as much as we can. Also, Celestial Packs are really good. Get that four of a kind upgrade, baby. Okay, another re-roll. Another four chance to upgrade level of poker hand is actually really good for us. If I had the slot for it, I might consider it. Looking for another three here. Uh, yeah, I gotta take it. Buy and sell that immediately. Next two there. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, there's the water. Uh-oh. We were just talking about that. That's very bad for us. Hopefully I can buy and sell enough stuff from the next shop to make it better. 
Ooh, discard for the tarot. That's nice. Stone card, not going to do much. Actually, this could be helpful. Yeah, it's not bad for a four of the kind deck. Chip bonus there. This is coming together. Colony's looking better now, too. Mars there. Any Mars is going to be outstanding. Another stone card. Ooh. Wild Hollow Gold Seal 9. I feel like I gotta take that, but that's just more. As good as that is, we're going all in on the threes here, I think, dude, and we just gotta focus on whatever's gonna improve that. Oh, I forgot to do the campfire stuff, shit. Um, I mean, we just need one four of a kind and we're good. Maybe we'll get lucky here. See how we're doing without it anyway. Yeah, honestly, it's not terrible without it. We'll play a glass card with this. Let's see if we can get away without risking one, because I'm sure that hand is going to be more than enough. Let's see if I can find a non-glass three here. There we go. This should be fine. Yeah, it's definitely going up on YouTube. Name. I honestly just forgot to schedule it to upload today, but I'll put it up tomorrow morning. The Palacho from the TCL from yesterday. All right, let's see. We've reset our campfire here. I think overstock is a really good idea, but let's buy the Neptune and sell it first. This is a free shuffle after that. Hmm. Additional discard's nice, but we're to the point where it's going to be very difficult to swap out anything. Three is in Fibonacci. That's a good point. I don't know if I've got the economy yet to uh, to maintain campfire, although I would really hate to get rid of that right now. Honestly, Scary Face isn't as important anymore. I think I could sell Scary Face and Paradolia. Pardon me. And I could just go for other plays. Because this makes up for a lot of the chips that we get from this just by being foil anyway. I think that's a good idea. Let me say that gives us a campfire boost right away, too. And then maybe just sell Paradelia for Fibonacci? That's pretty good. I think that's a good idea. Yeah. And then let's go for that Celestial. Get the Mars again. Yeah, okay. That looks, that looks right. I need to upgrade flush. God damn, we're already at any eight. That's crazy. Okay, all threes again. Nothing but threes. Good enough. Five of a kind. Actually, worse. I guess I could go that route at some point, though. Or no, we don't want to do that because we have the family. That's right. We specifically want to go for of a kind. Strength is still really good. Let me buy and sell the justice here. Go for the standard pack for another three. Um, I don't think I want to add anything that's not a three. Actually, it's kind of risky to go for those, I guess. Yeah, there's no reason to add any other fodder. I hate how five of a kind doesn't get the four of a kind upgrade. Well, it's, it's weird because there's, that's not always the case, right? Because there's ones that will say like benefits from a pair, but will also add the value when you score a four of a, or when you score like a full house or something like that. So it's not consistent. So yeah, I'm, I'm kind of with you on that. It's, it's weird. Family does work on five. Of, oh, okay. So it's so it is consistent though. Well, that's good. <laughs> that's fun. It's the difference between played X hand versus contains X hand. Oh, sure. Yeah, that, that's perfect then. Okay. Speaking of like Magic the Gathering esque specificities. 
Yeah, that totally checks out. Hot diggity damn. I'm just gonna go ahead and sell that too. That's a nice little 3.5 there. It's all about the keywords, yeah, no kidding. Full card is not bad, honestly. Yeah, I could just go ahead and get another Mars out of this. Destroy two more cards, though, is actually pretty damn good. Probably even better than what I was gonna do. And try for another three. Hey Bear, love your vid love your vids on YouTube. I am a big frog. Hello, big frog. Thanks for watching the YouTube vids. Appreciate that. Yay, thin deck. Yeah, we're still at 53, but a lot more focus now. 15 of the 53 are threes, so it's looking pretty good. Hopefully gonna be a couple more right now. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm gonna look for twos here, weirdly. Maybe not use all our discards, that seems risky. I'll just go ahead and do that for now. And again, we really want to try to get three three of hearts, if possible, for the additional multiplier off of Lusty. Let's go! Another W. Well, that's not what we're after. Got bigger fish to fry, buckaroo. Planet cards appear more frequently. It's probably not a bad investment, but I'm still trying to maintain our interest here. We never really got an economy joker, so I'm just trying to keep our pool of cash a little larger. I really haven't found the ideal way to scale up for this one besides the campfire here either. That's another Mars is worth it. Certainly have gotten that up pretty high. Remember when the blue chip line seemed impossible? Yeah. How uh, far we've come, huh? I think this is worth it, yeah. Let's see if I can just find another Mars right away. Double probability is not gonna happen. Yeah, we're good. Rare Joe. Ooh, rare polychrome joker. Holy shit. Gotta go for that. Gotta go for that. Oh, we got our three of hearts. Nice. Yeah, I have Mars always in the Celestials. It's our, um, it's our voucher. And just send it, dude. I'm pretty sure we're good to go here. Sick. Ah, oh, man. I mean, this is kind of helpful, actually. You know what? I think it's good enough. I think it's good enough because, first of all, it's got a pretty nice benefit. Second of all, it's polychrome. Third of all, we want to destroy sixes. Ooh, planet cards appear four times more frequently. And hologram. Sadly, not a great time for hologram. Normally, I'm very excited to see hologram. But right now, I don't think it's the play. I think it's a little too late. We're not adding the playing cards anyway. We're taking cards out. Let's go spectral here. That's not a good idea. I could change this to a or to a non-heart. And then I guess uh, this is kind of a whiff. I guess I could do this and take a chance. Yeah, it's, it doesn't really matter. Um, Mars again. And then you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna take this too. It's another voucher to discover at the very least. Fifty-five dollars is a really tempting proposition. And I'm gonna play one hand on Needle anyway. It's just a matter of whether or not I want to try to get Campfire boosted before that, which I think I do, and then the only reason, or the only way to, to do that more than likely is to play Speed Tag, so... Sounds good! So I'm playing the first hand single six this time. It should work. Ooh, gold seal for a three is nice. Ooh, steel queen, too. Oh, this is gambling big time. Oh, I don't like this play. I should discard the stone and the queen. There we go. Another gold seal there. Yeah, let's play the two so we can get another card. I'm not sure this is going to be enough here. Yeah, not quite. Ooh. Oh, we're not going to make it. Oh, no. 
That's a rip. That's a ripperino, dude. Bummer. Yeah, my campfire wasn't nearly good enough for this. Damn, that stinks. Oh well. That was a good run. Learned a lot there. We unlocked something there too. New voucher. Plus one hand size. <laughs> of course. That's a great voucher to unlock, though, actually. That's really nice. Hopefully we can find that when we play tomorrow. All right. Run it back. Yeah, we didn't really find any scaling that time, unfortunately. Hopefully we can get better luck here. Kind of want to go for a straight flush. Yeah, let's just take the straight. I think that clears anyway. Yeah, we're good. It's the same as Paintbrush, I think, yeah. There's there's vouchers that do the same thing. Credit card? I hate credit card. I don't want to get that. Let's just do this so we can save money, but... Eh, yeah, we're good. Oh, it's the upgraded paintbrush. So you can get the paintbrush and then get another one. Got it. Okay, yeah. And that's, that's the case a lot of the time, too. Oh, shit. Again, I think I just play this straight. Yeah, let's just do that. As close as it is, and of course we're going to draw the Ten of Diamonds immediately here, right? No, okay, good. Justified. Mm, I got a flush brewing. Let's just go for that instead. Or not. Seven clubs, man. Come on now. Come on now. Help me out. Don't do this to me. There we go. Right? Nice. Okay. Come on, Rare Joker. Let's get cooking. Ooh, that's very fun to start off with. Holographic, too. Outstanding. We might be going on a, on a similar road here. Let's see what else we can find. So, let's copy Aces. That usually ends up being a pretty good idea. We can build a lot of things off of that. And we'll start looking for ace plays to help us out. Yeah, DNA is a really fun one. Golden Joker's good for the economy, too. Let's pick that up right now. And we don't have any scoring help at the moment, so I feel like I might need to re-roll this. We have the holographic, but that's not going to be enough for the next couple of anties here, so... And again, I could just could just send it. Let's see what happens. I don't know if I can afford a copy still, but I do still want to, certainly. Let's try it. Hmm, this is risky business. Yeah, I'm not making smart plays here. I'm pretty sure I'm going to lose on this one. I just need one really good one, though, and I guess I'm going for the kings and queens. If I don't get it, I'm probably going to die. Yep. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, wow. That was surprising. Yeah, damn. Holographic is really, really strong early. Cool. Oh, hello. Very fun combination with DNA. Oh, yeah, we got to go for that. That is nice. We got to start feeding it immediately. So let's get those enhanced cards. And yeah, with a red seal especially. Hell yeah, dude. I want to get this too, but I don't think it's worth spending the 10 bucks on right now. I think I'd rather have the money. All clubs are debuffed, all right? Copying that ace again. Good stuff. Get that discard. That discard. Beautiful. Should not be an issue. Excellent. All right, man. Getting going. Always buy and sell bank card to stick it to the banks. I, I'm with that. Yeah, that's 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 good practice. 
I know Vampire's good, but I still can't get it to work in my runs. You need something to feed it. Like, it's very difficult to get Vampire going unless you have something that's going to be an engine for it. Like, just trying to buy cards from standard packs is a very slow process. So if we have, like, DNA, for example, where we can take one bonus card and then just copy it. And also, like, the magical thing about this synergy is that each instance in which we play a single card to copy with DNA that is itself an enhanced card is going to trigger the vampire. But I believe the enhancement will stay on the copy card. I'm not 100% on that. It might be the opposite, which would be a lot worse. But I think it's the first, I think it's the first way. We'll find out soon enough, I'm sure. I think I should take the slide joker too. I feel like I need a little bit of extra help right now. And those chips can be a big difference maker. I don't need vouchers. All right, so we're still copying the Ace of Hearts for now without a better option at the moment. I think DNA clones first if it's less than most. That makes sense to me. Hopefully that's the case. So this contains a pair, so should give us plus 50 chips. That's cool. I like that. Yeah, let's go ahead and play a two pair here as well. Should be pretty good. Nice. Taffy is woo wooing right now. All right, so yeah, really all we care about right now is trying to find ways to enhance our cards. So our cannon packs are going to be a great way to do that. Also, double our money is a nice option too. Yeah, let's just do that. Always good to get the economy going. And let's see here. More chips for remaining discards is nice early, but kind of expensive. I actually can benefit from this. I'm creating a bunch of aces, and we're probably going to be able to make some straights pretty easily here. I could try that. I'll take this Celestial pack, too, just to maybe level that up. As Apollo has said, though, before, straight builds are kind of cringe. Not really something you can rely on. All right, so we'll get our first test here. My theory is that if we play this kind of card, it will count for Vampire. It will consume the enhancement on the original card, but I think the clone will have it still. Let's find out. That's incredible. That That is, that is so good. Oh, we are, we are on to something here now. I gotta keep this run going. This is fantastic. Let's see. Get our flush. Try for a hard flush after that, I guess. Yeah, we still need some help. Still not quite where we want to be. Mostly why I wanted to buy some actual scoring jokers, too. Oh boy, yeah, this is not good. That's nice. Okay. I think that should clear. It's got the chip bonus for the pair. <clears throat> for the pair as well, yeah. Alright, so we need to sell super position. We need to sell golden joker. And we need to start actually getting stuff that's going to help our scoring. And that'll do it. That'll do it. Okay. Now, let's look for another bonus card. That'll work. That's probably good. That's probably good. Well, spades are debuffed. All right. Looking for our first bonus card to copy again. Oh, I got a straight there. That's nice. Hmm. I really should copy. I really should discard to try to find a copy, but this feels very risky. But I'm going to do it. Oh, okay. Well, let's just play this, I guess. Multis go left of the X-Multis, Ebony, for sure. Yeah, that's best practice. Well, we're going to clear it, at least. Just a little scary. shot at it there, damn. Okay. I feel like I gotta get rid of Golden Joker at some point, but 
It's been all that tempting so far. Let's hit this jumbo spectral right away. Anything that adds a bunch of enhanced cards in the deck, like Incantation, is going to be outstanding for us right now. Naturally, I had to get rid of the one enhanced card in that lot, but whatever. I gotta go ahead and re-roll once or twice here, too. Let's see if I can get some more bonus cards in the mix. Yeah, wild card's good enough, I guess. That'll do it. And re-roll once. Ice cream is pretty good. It's better than the slide joker. Yeah, we can do that. One in four chance to upgrade the level of the play poker hand is tempting, too. But, nah, I think we're good. Foil joker? I could go for that. Why don't they replace golden, maybe? Sure, let's do it. Still looking for bonuses to clone right now. I think that's more important than anything. Let's try to go for that hard flush too here, I guess. At the same time. There's that. Play for the DNA copy and the vampire absorbs it. Nearly 5k off that. Holy shit, that's crazy. Cool, okay. Starting to scale up a little bit more now, although of course we are relying on uh, Gross Michael for that, which is not really ideal. Ooh, this could go hard. Could also just replace ice cream right now. I'm gonna get something to make the rerolls cheaper. And then a stone card is outstanding, actually. That's a really good one to pick up. And let's see if I can find another bonus card in the standard pack. That'll work. That's really nice. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay. Slowly building that vampire. Yeah, we're getting there. Wow. Holy shit. Pretty good odds of getting ourselves a straight flush to start off with here. Let's go ahead and start with that stone card copy. 3k off of 6 of diamonds. Love to see it. Uh, let's try to get that straight flush now, I guess. Might as well. Or a flush at the very least. Oh, I'm, I'm gut-shotting this, actually. Never mind. Yeah, let's just take the straight. This is fine. I realized I was looking for the jack instead of the queen. I thought it was up and down. Ah, two steel cards in there now. I could actually score those. I think they're better feeding Vampire. No, they're better by themselves. I think I keep Steel Cards as much as I can, actually. I'll go ahead and go for the Club Flush again. That's probably good enough. Okay. 2.2 in the Vampire is pretty good. Ah, there goes Gross Michael. Okay. Gonna need to fix that right away. Canna pack for sure. Ooh, lower cost rerolls is really good. Really helpful right now. I don't think it's wheel. I think it's death. Oh, actually. Oh. Huh. It'd be fun for DNA, actually. Rerolls are definitely helpful now. Ooh, bonus cards, perfect. Yeah, it's probably good. Okay. Oh, Mega Arcana is tempting. That could be really good. Hmm. I think I'll go for that. I think it's worth it. So we're going to go for the uh, Hierophant first. So we can get the bonuses on these guys. And then we're going to Fool here. Get another hero fan on these guys. And then. Probably a stone card after that. Makes the most sense to me. Alright, cool. Is high card upgrade worth it? I don't think so. I think for now we're playing high cards just sort of by default. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not the way we're going to want to go long term with it. Okay, let's see. 2.4 is pretty nice. The flush is still doing all right here. Yeah, stone counts as an enhanced card. 
Oh, this is looking sketchy, though. I was thinking I might have needed a little bit more scoring help here. Might be the case. So close. I need one club from this discard, and I think we'll get it. Thank goodness. Okay. Oh, to do. We need to help our scoring a lot right now. So I think Hanging Chad and Golden Joker have got to go. I gotta find ways to improve them before I can do that. Hermit's not a bad play here. Hermit and Emperor, I think. Yeah, that makes sense. Maybe another Hermit. Oh, Steel card and a Lucky card. Okay. That's not bad. Let's go ahead and do this. Oh, nice. Go ahead and use these right away. And let's make this a Lucky. is good. Let's go ahead and run the wheel real quick. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Foil Vampire! Nice! Okay. Hit the re-roll again. Let's go for the Lover's card. Walkie Talkie is at least something. Eh, it's too specific. Ooh, Rocket's better than Golden Joker. Let's take that. And then... Hmm. Hmm, 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 I think that'll have to do for now. I want to I wanna do one more reroll, though. Just to add to that for the most part. Yeah, there we go. Losing a dollar per card played, is he? Yikes. It's unfortunate. I think I'll death this five. Let's save our, save our resources for this round. I am pretty worried that we're not going to be able to hit score here. I'm wondering if I can actually afford the DNA. I'm going to do it, but I fear I may regret it. Got a double discard there at least. That's pretty nice. I do have four clubs, but I'm pretty sure I want to do this. Flush does count as a straight flush, yeah. Huh. Whoa. Okay. Ooh, we could actually get crazy good vampire value here. Not to mention play a flush house. That's cool. Alright, that'll do it. Vampire soaks it up and off we go. Not bad. To the moon! Uh, it's a bit early for seed money. Okay. Let's take a gamble. Let's see what we get. Free reroll is actually really good right now. Lucky cat. Interesting. Huh. That voucher's good. I don't know if I can afford to pay for it right now, though. Yeah, vampire eats lucky, so... As tempting as that is, I don't think it's the player here despite the fact that we're cloning the Luckies a lot of the time. Let's see if I can get Lucky here, though. Well, that's pretty good. Mm, I think I'll take the re-trigger, yeah. Do, 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 do. 
I, I'll be competing in this one, unfortunately, feature list, but I do uh, want to do more commentary with Apollo because it's always fun. I'm hoping we get another opportunity to do that together soon. Eh, bowl's pretty good. I guess I'll take that. Got a lot of bonus for flash card there, too, at least. Okay, that's probably good enough for now. Double your money. Pretty good. Oh, we got the extra large blind coming up. Oh, yikes. I don't know if we got the strength for this yet. I think we need to take more rounds for rocket money. And also more opportunities to clone. Let's go ahead and destroy these two. Less non-bonus cards. There we go. Play that. Jesus Christ, that was nearly enough score by itself. That's crazy. I guess I better play more vampire cards here. Or try to, anyway. It doesn't really matter what I play. Discord that guy. Ah, never mind, damn. Yeah, whatever. Literally anything will do it here. Sweet. Sigil's always fun. There's no drawback to it either, which is nice. I think the gold seal is super important. Yeah, let's just do that for fun. Oops, all clubs. Ooh, negative raised fist is really good. Oh, yeah. I'll take that for free, man. God damn, add double the rank of lowest card held in hand to multiplier. Phenomenal. For that. Four of a kind out of the gate. Holy shit. I don't even have that many tens. That's six in the deck. That's wild. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Um, still trying to find a bonus card here, but I think those five tens will probably clear this round. I don't need to clone anything either, so yeah, fuck it. Will do. Guess this can go over here. Hermit, hell yeah. Money for sale. Seed money's starting to become a little more tempting here. Straight up, just play it more. Coffee. I was way worse at this a couple weeks ago than I am now. You just got to play more. You just got to get the experience under your belt. Increase rank doesn't really matter here. I guess it's planet card time. I haven't really done any planet cards yet. And the high card is actually going to help quite a bit. Okay, I'm pack again. I think I am going to get some money now, actually. Let's get the bonus cards. Yeah, let's do it. And the rerolls aren't as valuable as I'm making them out to be. All right, here we go. Very much would like to get Vampire going, but I also need to consider the fact that I actually need a good scoring hand this time around, so that's probably going to take priority here. Oh, that'll do, that'll work. <laughs> Jesus Christ, how does this keep happening now? All right, well, that was a fun wall, I guess. Oh, not quite. Wow, damn. I had to play two hands on this one. Jeez Louise. Okay, let's see. Oh boy. Not a lot of help here. I want to get the re rolling again. Nope. Oh, you know what I need to do, actually? Hold on a second. I need to add the nope emote. Where is that? This is a very specific new better Twitch TV emote for this game that Apollo has in his channel that I want so badly. Ah, there's too many nope emotes, dude. 
What if I search nope Bellatro? No, that doesn't help at all. Okay, I'll find it later. Let's re-roll once here. Ooh, nice. Perfect find there. I'm go for the lucky card. Oh! How many how many kings do we have? Only four. Hmm, that's a foil too. That's uh that's gonna be good enough, I think, man. That's real nice. Let's get rid of Rocket. That's awesome. Okay. I think I'm gonna put that over there, don't I? Yeah, for the chips. Hollow Joker. I don't know if I can afford it. Nah, I think we're good. Alright, we're still looking for our bonus boys. I guess we can just get an automatic lucky card here, and that's fine. Oh, duh, clone kings. Yeah, why? Uh, obviously, I should be doing that. I should have put the lucky on the king, too. I didn't even think about it. Thank you, Cho. <laughs> oh, there we go. Nice. Perfect. Now we just find a king. Although, I kind of want to play the full house, too. With the bonuses, specifically. But I want a king to clone. And I can always just clone an ace or something, I guess. Yeah, all right. Whatever. Second lucky card? Should I hold that? I feel like I might want to hold that. Good God. That is crazy. Okay. I don't think I need the additional consumable slot. Still looking for money here with the seed money. No need for that. Oh, baby. <laughs> That'll get the economy going. I haven't gotten this one yet either. I kind of want to try it, but I'm pretty sure that's not the play here. That's a fun one, though. A dollar scored for every diamond suit card. I actually think I might just send it here. The upgrade for the voucher is good. Oh, that's true. Yeah, it might be worth it just for that. Oh, that's a good point. Ah, oh, jeez. I guess we're good. I don't know why I'm re-rolling so much. Got the optimal amount of money there anyway. All right, we're discarding for kings still, so we can hopefully clone those. We'll just keep finding five of the kind aces instead. There we go. Now we make that lucky. Let me play it by itself, and then clones that for the DNA, and there we go. Get the multiplier too. Nice. Looking good on the money. Ooh, we got Cavendish too. That's fun. It's probably better than Flashcard now. Hmm. What do y'all think? Should I sell bowl or flash card here? I think it's bowl, because we're getting a good amount of chips from flash card too. And we're not always gonna have money, but the more money we have, the better bowl becomes. But ideally we're not gonna keep all our cash, we're gonna be spending it on good stuff. I think because this is only gonna get better. And this is potentially going to get worse. I think we sell bull for that reason. And for that reason, I'm out. Whoa! Huh. This could upgrade high cards significantly. Ooh. Yeah. Especially polychrome. Oh shit. That's cool. That's a that's a good looking card too, isn't it? Yeah, that's fun. Okay, okay. Yeah, obviously no obelisk. Face cards becoming gold cards is weirdly helpful for us, but I'm pretty sure that's not worth replacing anything here. Okay. Let's do this. Go ahead and play this eight. No, we still want to go for, um, I want to try to go for the kings. So we're going to do this. 
Minus would be sick with Vampire, yeah. It's just that I don't want to get rid of anything that we've got anymore. I'm pretty happy with everything we got now. <sighs> Come on, Kings. Come on, Kings. Where are you at? Here's one, but it's debuffed. All right. Oh, I can't play this and clone it now, can I? Shit. Because it's debuffed. That stinks. Okay. So let's do this. Let's clone the three. I'll moon it. Nah, that wouldn't matter. It's not the suit, it's the face card. Oh, you mean like pull my pants down at it? I don't think that would matter either, unfortunately. Yeah, this is actually a really nasty debuff. I'm glad we saw this now, because if we got this later, we would have been, been totally screwed by it. Uh, I can't discard that either, damn. Oh well. So we're, we're scaling off kings now. Far and away, that is the most important thing, is to try to be able to get more kings. So hopefully we can manage that. Hmm. I think we tarot. Or emperor, I mean. Ooh, strength is really good. That'll help us turn our queens into kings. And then let's reroll again. No longer benefiting from the reroll nearly as much, so I guess I shouldn't be doing that all that often. Polychrome, I don't think so. Yeah, I think we need to play these blinds. We need to do everything in our power to get more kings. So first of all, looking for queens is a good way to do that. Hopefully we can find one more here. The high card upgrade again. Nice. That is perfect. Use this. And then... We don't have a way to turn it into a bonus card right now, unfortunately. I could discard again. It's not a terrible idea. And then one more discard for the five, I guess. Okay. Ah, oh, they're all convert. That sucks. Well, I want to copy the king for sure. That's crazy. Holy shit. I love these kinds of builds, dude. This is fun. Well, now a gold card actually helps a lot. Okay, we can do that. And then try to find another king in there. No luck. Got another tarot going. Hermit's probably the play here. I can make another king there, though. Probably for the best. Okay. This is the one we wanted earlier because we do have 10 aces in this deck, but definitely not the play anymore. Okay. Let's use this. Discard this guy. Prove the high card first. Ooh, another strength card is outstanding. Let's keep doing this. So we're still waiting to clone this guy. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah. Let's do. Let's do that, and then clone it. Oh no, no, no! Do this first. Ooh, that's fun. Yeah, why not? Nope! Pretty bonkers, dude. Spectral again. Hmm. Actually, this is really good. Yeah, this is this is really nice. Let's get rid of five non kings. And hopefully, we can find another one right here. There's a steel card. That's not bad. I can go for that. Although that is a lot worse than the king right now, isn't it? Yeah. Maybe I can strength it twice. That's fun. 
Bonus cards is good. Probably sell this moon. Yeah. There we go. Flip and shuffle all jokers is actually kind of rough. I will at least know where DNA is. And then I just need to look at where the multipliers are once we score. I feel like I just watched it happen. There's DNA. We know we can put that on the far right. Or the far left, I mean. We have a queen for strength here. That is the burnt joker, meaning we want to move that to the far left as well. Okay. Um, let's do this. Oh, right, I always forget that the multiplier order doesn't matter for them. I have it in my head for some reason that it did. Playing our bonus king. Might as well get a stone card in there too. Or no, 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 we don't want to do that. We'll play it by itself. There's the king. There's the Cavendish. Let's go. Back into endless, baby. Easy peasy. All right, cool. Ooh, spectral cards may appear in any of the Arcana packs. That's what we were going for. Hell yeah. Fool for the strength card is pretty good there. Let me go ahead and bonus these guys as well. Oh, right. Yeah, duh. Damn it. Um, well, I guess bonus these guys too then, huh? Can I do that? Yeah. Oh, but right. Yeah, okay. Um... Destroy two cards is pretty good. Non-kings. We can go ahead and get rid of those guys by now. Let's go ahead and do that, actually. I don't think I want steel cards anymore. But maybe... Eh, maybe too early to tell. I am going to discard him now, at least. Okay. Can make that into a bonus. Might as well keep that guy, I guess. I think we're just going to turn those into bonuses, it's looking like. Yeah, the vamp can eat steel later. That's mostly why I was thinking about keeping it. I think that's good enough justification. I think I've built my deck to 80 before. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have. Hermit's probably the way to go there, yeah. Economy's kind of rolling. Mm, not good. Hollow misprint. Not terrific. We'll pop the Emperor there. Death card's really good. We should turn this. Oh, it's going to get rid of the red seal if I do that, though, isn't it? Damn. That would be so good, but I don't think that's the play. Let's go ahead and make these guys into, or at least this guy into a lucky, and then I think I just go ahead and death that. That makes sense. And then our last discard here. Sun card doesn't really matter. I play this king. Cool. You know it would go really hard here is a hand size upgrade, actually. I really hope I can come across that voucher. Fool is really good as well. I'll sell this guy in front of the tower as well. Let's check this with Foon Pack, see if I get a negative.
that's probably enough for now. Cards drawn face down after each hand played isn't really going to matter here, I don't think. Shouldn't be an issue. Hell yeah, nice. That's really good. Go ahead and copy this guy. That conversion going. Cool, see what the Emperor gives me. It's Emperor, fuck yeah. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Nice deck size, yeah, that's ideal, isn't it? Alright, lucky king. Still crushing it. Tarot cards appear four times more frequently. Awesome. Yeah, we're pretty much exclusively looking for negatives at this point from the buffoon pack. I don't think celestial pack's really all that important right now either. I don't think I want to get a chariot. Hangman's still pretty good. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. This is a tempting one too, but I'm pretty sure it's a little late for this. Could get better than Cavendish, though, and that would certainly incentivize us to start using those Celestial Packs. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not the play, though. I think at some point we're probably going to want to replace Burnt Joker, too, and I suppose that would be a good a good candidate for it. A better way to upgrade things, and our economy is kind of popping off right now. It's very tempting, actually. I think this is going to be better value than this, though. Because it takes five planet cards to even reach the polychrome, and this is upgrading high card every round, so... Eh, I think we keep that for now. This is negative, so we're not going to replace that. That's just creating its own slot, so selling that would be pointless. Nope. Just a quick nope. Oh, yeah, Emperor card, absolutely. Ooh, baby. I'm gonna foil juggler, no thanks. Lucky card, sure. Might as well upgrade that. Okay. Eh, no thanks. I got some cash to spend. Let's go ahead and destroy some more cards here. Another high card upgrade again. for the two, sure. And then let's do another lucky. I guess I don't have to do it. Yeah, I can just play it. Oh my god, we actually have to play a hand to win? What is this madness? I'm gonna play a nine of clubs and see how that does. That did pretty good. this sure although probably do this first ooh ah, yeah that's not gonna work let's do this isn't really what we want is it yeah crap oh well even less non kings we have 18 kings in this deck now that's pretty good Still want to get these planets. I guess we just let's sell this guy. Actually, yeah, that feels better. Level up high card and pair again. That's pretty nice. Mm, nah. I'm gonna buy that to use it later. And yeah, see if I can find another king. Nope. Pretty good cards, but. card, sure. You have 18 kings, mostly clubs. I don't think you've played a flush five yet. Yeah, I don't think so either. Let's go ahead and make this a lucky boy. 
Let's see what our tarot is. Great pair again. Get our hermit. Nice. Need that for now. Wheel might as well. Hey, hollow Cavendish. Hell yeah, dude. That's dope. Well, let's go ahead and wheel again for fun. Oh, I can't. <laughs> I have all foil, hollow, and polychrome jokers. I, li I literally can't use wheel anymore. That's crazy. All right, let's clone another lucky boy. Still not quite there. Okay, I think we need to start thinking about getting rid of Bird Joker. Oh, here we go. <laughs> we found mine. That's pretty good. So now he's going to re-trigger all the King's Held in Hand ability. Pretty nice. Let's get more Kings. Now I can use Wheel, that's true. Still card's still tempting, but I don't think so. <laughs> okay, okay. Now we're cooking with gas. Holy shit. I think it is time to say goodbye to DNA, isn't it? Yeah, I think we've had our fun with DNA. Oh man, wow. That is crazy. Blueprint Mime re-triggers all King Multipliers. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. Negative fucking... Oh, I thought it was negative Blackboard, dude. Oh, man. I got so excited. That would be nutty. Okay, good enough. Hot damn, dude. No longer upgrading or discarded. All oh, right, we're gonna draw three on this one, okay. So I gotta like discard two and draw three, I guess is ideal. No, this isn't good. Okay, we don't have DNA anymore, so we do at least have one scoring hand left. One additional scoring hand, rather. Uh, let's lucky it up. I think I'm going to go ahead and glass card this guy. And then I guess we just play a four of a kind. That's probably way worse than the high card, isn't it? Yeah, the high card's way better right now. Plus, that keeps the kings in hand. Oh, yeah, we don't even want to play the king, right? Yeah, play ace high. Yeah, okay. And then the rest of the cards so we can get more. Although, I guess we're only getting three, so... Two? Oh no, we are we have over hand size right now. So if we do that, then we should be good. Plus I'm pretty sure this is just gonna clear it anyway. Yeah, it's getting good. That's why we got excited about that pair right there. Retrigger all face cards. Alright, see you later, Cavendish. That's fun. Negative seltzer! What the fuck? Oh! That's gonna be good, dude. Why couldn't this have shown up tomorrow? God damn. Is it played face cards? Oh, man. Ah, I didn't see. It's not going to help. Okay. Okay. We got to replace that. We're still good, though. We're, we're easily going to clear the next one. It's just we got to find one to replace that. Hmm. Just means play queen high. 
Or you get the Joker that makes all face cards golden with that. Oh well, yeah, that's fun too, but I don't think we got the space for that anymore. So wait, if we play a queen, will the queen re-trigger each instance of the king multiplier then? As long as it's a played face card? Oh, sick, okay. Well, that's not a problem then. We can do that. Negative Joker, holy shit. That could be really big. So we just need to find a queen or a jack. Which we have a good amount of those still. Yeah, we have six of those left. Total, which is not a ton, but... Hopefully we can get it to work. Should maybe add more uh, queens to the deck, actually. Could have double skip for double negatives. Yeah, probably was the right play, actually. I didn't even think about that. That's a good point. I should have done that. Oh, there's the kings. I, I can just play a king, too, right? That's fine. That works. Yeah, let's just play a king. So it still leaves five in the hand, and this should trigger this, I think. I don't think it works like that. It's working pretty well. Yeah, I don't think this does what we want it to do. I think we need to find a replacement for that. Pretty damn good, though. Let's see what the random gives us. Odd <laughs> Todd. Okay. Uh, let's see. Um, I'll do this. Arcana pack for a, a possible spectral. Probably just double our money again. Let's see if we can find another queen or jack here. No luck. That's eh, not gonna matter. The emperor is good. We get a judgment out of this too. Hangman's still good. Oh, strength is good too. Actually, yeah, I gotta get, gotta get that. Actually, this is nice. That's a uh, that's a good thing to have. I can grab that here. I might actually need this. And while we don't need the help from anything else, it's a good thing to grab. But I still think I should look for more. Hmm. It's a surprise tool. It'll help us later. Yeah, there you go. Negative time. Okay. Um, yeah, we're good. Let's do it. This is going to hurt us discarding the two hearts per hand plate, but not enough to use the luchador on it. Yeah, I can death a queen here. That's probably a good call. Let's do that. Previously, I would have wanted to immediately strength that, but that's not the play anymore. We'll keep the one queen. I don't think we keep the steel cards, actually. The kings are way more valuable than the steel cards right now. So let's just do this. Oh, wait, no, keep the queen. That's right. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's try that out. Keeping the queen so we can keep the kings in hand for the multipliers, because the, we can play the kings, but it's way better for each king that we can keep in hand. Like, I'm going to play a jack here so I can... Oh, actually, it doesn't matter anymore, does it? That's right, yeah, we don't care about playing the face cards anymore. Never mind. I, I don't know why I was still thinking that. That was dumb. Yeah, we're just playing whatever. Yeah, high ace is slightly better now, right, because of the additional... Um... Oh, don't... don't... Ah, oh, shit. Okay, I'm, I'm making mistakes here. It might actually cost me. I need to keep the other two cards in hand. I need to keep this so that I can have the chance to keep the kings. Oh, this is getting sketchy now. I think I might need to do this just so I don't... I mean, it's not doing much any, anyway, just sitting there. I think we need to do that so we can make sure that we keep the kings in hand. And then we need to make sure that we have more chances of getting kings, too. 
Oh, that was good for Vampire, too. I didn't even think about that. All right, we should be good here. I think if we play the nine, we're going to be okay. That, that was it by itself. Okay, so that's <laughs> that's reassuring, at least. That shows me that we are still on the right track here. Ah, uh, that's a terrible negative, damn it. I mean, I guess I guess I can feed the other bad negative into it, but uh, that's not really what I wanted to see. Yeah, it doesn't really get any value when it's on. I guess I can do this, but it doesn't really feel right either. Additional discard's pretty good. I just need any... Oh! No. Damn it. No, that's not it. Yeah, no, I still have a Joker slot, too. I just need to find anything to help. That's not gonna be it, either. God damn it. Come on, man. Give us something. need chips, right? Yeah, that's the big thing right now. Yeah, I guess I could just feed Dagger, but I, I really feel like I need something to help me immediately. I think I'm going to maybe need to re-roll until I find something effective. Uh, this is getting really expensive really fast, though. One more try. That doesn't help at all, does it? Nope. One um, more try. Not at all helpful either. One more try. God damn it. I'm gonna get the money back at least. One more try. Double money. <laughs> One more try. Oh, random joker. You know what? Yeah, let's try that. Wow. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Huh. That's some good flat molt right there. Yeah, it's probably good enough for now. Okay. Um, send it. Fuck it. Rare Joker? That actually might be what we need. I mean, we're gonna die here anyway. So, fuck it. Let's go 450. Okay. Okay. This boy's a plus 10. So plus 88 on the on the flat value there is pretty good. I'm going to keep an ace so we can play, play an ace high. I don't know. I, honestly, I don't think it matters that much. I do want to make another king out of this guy. I guess this might as well happen. Okay. This is ideal here. Just a handful of kings. So I think I just do this, actually. Yeah, this makes a lot of sense. Okay. Still not quite enough, unfortunately, man. I don't think we're going to get there. Might have been able to clear, clear 300, actually. I think I got a little greedy with this. Oh, this is nice. Get the red seal there, at least. Yeah, let's do that. Get an, an extra eight chips. <laughs> oh, and Seltzer isn't helping us that much, is it? Yeah, because it's only triggering the cards we play. It's not triggering our queens, so... That's not nearly as exciting as I thought, either. Well, it was fun. Good run. Pretty hilarious to have a handful of kings at the end here, too. Let's throw the lucky boy up there and see what he can do. Now, is it bonus or is it lucky here? Because he gets the plus 10 chips by default, right? I'm going to have the chance for the plus 20 molt. I think it's bonus, isn't it? Yeah, I guess bonus is better. 
I don't think I don't think full hand is the way to go now. I think each king in left in hand is far more important than the value we could get from adding it into the hand itself. That's solid, dude. That's like significantly higher than the high score I got yesterday. Still not quite where we're looking to get, but it feels pretty good. 278 mil. I'll take that. I think we got another unlock that round too, didn't we? Got a winter run without playing a pair. Next two mold with a pair in hand. That's pretty nice. Cool. All right. Good day in Bellatro, y'all. Good practice for tomorrow. Tune on in or uh, tune in tomorrow about uh, noon ish, I think, my time, which is 11 a.m. Pacific. We'll be doing the finals of the Bellatro tournament. Looking forward to that. Hopefully, we can get a, an even better run going then.